Hello and welcome everybody, I am Adam the Silly Host and we are back at playing some Minecraft. Uh, not much at the moment, just a little to look around uh, at my creative world where I put down some things uh, that uh, 117 gave us. So let's take a quick look. Uh, the first thing is these uh, dripping stones that are really interesting. Uh, for one reason is that because uh, as you can see it can hurt <laughs> quite much um, there are also many many new blocks with uh, some has amazing and some are not so much uh, amazing textures as you can see these the ores. These have uh, different textures, even though they are pretty much the same as far as I know. The darker ones are the deep slate ones that you find uh, at really deeper levels in the game. But uh, as I understood, there is not much of a difference, just uh, they have darker textures. Uh, I still don't really like these new textures, I still think that this is like a blurry pixelated of the old textures, but eh, whatever. Uh, there is the new thing, the copper of course, and the old thing that we can all already find. Um, this, the deep slate coal, this might be a nice building block uh, out of those, because it's a little darkish themed, so I might be able to use that for some things, but uh, generally, probably the deep slate uh, itself is the best building block as look at these deep slate tiles i think that this looks really amazing there are cracked versions chiseled versions stairs half slabs so you can do a lot of things with that uh, we have this new thing here the goat which uh, was ad advertised like they kick down other animals and stuff, but let's make a cow. No, they are... Oh, wow! Oh, wow! Oh, wow, so they do it with other animals. Wow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> just, uh, don't you dare well I am creative mode anyway but still so okay that's good to know anyway deep slate tires dripstone I mean this can grow and actually uh, drips water now we will have to see if something uh, gets created or not Anyway, let's move on. These are the new blocks, like raw iron, copper, gold, amethyst. The, those look really nice and lovely, would be nice for some decoration. And of course the copper. Now I put down many kinds of it, and the last ones of these are actually waxed. So these should not change color over time so they should not weather but because the weather is pretty much turned off here i don't think that the rest uh, actually will but as you can see you can make blocks uh, with different now that looks a little off uh, weird stairs half slabs uh, anything what i love the most probably uh, is the azalea tree i mean this just looks amazing and I accidentally came up on it as I was putting down these small trees and just... Uh, oh, no. You don't do that. Uh, I need here bone meal. So... Look at that. They grew like naturally good looking shapes. And I think that that is amazing as they look like. I, mean, I will definitely plant as many trees as I can. Amazing. Candles, of course. Oh. 
you can put down from one to four like so it gets four and if you have a flint and steel then you can actually light them now if you put down more and light them every single one of them gets lit wow that actually destroyed them yeah because i am in creative mode another lovely thing these things Axolot, something like that. I cannot pronounce that name properly, but they are so cute. I can actually bucket them, which is amazing. I will definitely uh, collect some of these guys as pets. As you can see, they have uh, multiple different colors. Oh, and it seems that this tree indeed drops little. Uh, Oh, I cannot pick it up like that, but uh, anyway, so it seems that these trees uh, drop sometimes uh, smaller ones of themselves that you can go plant and have more, which is amazing. Uh, free color. Um, not sure if I am correct or not, but I have a feeling that... Uh, like they are all pink and they turn colors uh, when they are exposed to the sun. I am not 100% sure about that. Uh, one thing is interesting, they come out uh, onto the land sometimes, but they are so slow while uh, walking on land, so um, you really have to check what predators might hunt them. Because as you can see on land they slow down in water they move around nicely and uh, for some reason they hunt glow squids no idea why but they do <laughs> they actually uh, go and hunt them down Which is quite interesting, I think. <laughs> uh, what else do we have? We have the goat. Is this pretty much it? Uh, no, we always, we have a backlit item frame, which I don't know what's the purpose of that so far, but... Um, I will figure it out. Maybe it just uh, uh, looks nicer at night. But anyway, oh, we have the glow berries. Glow berries uh, you can pretty much plant uh, on the bottom of blocks. So far, I have tried many kinds of blocks, and I uh, uh, I want to have a tree. So you can plant them on many type of blocks but uh, only on the bottoms and they grow over time and uh, at some point the bottom one will uh, yield glow berries but you can also do bone meal to quicken the process when you can just harvest them just like that easy peasy uh, another thing this is a glow lichen Leichen? I still don't know how to pronounce it. I want to go for like Germanic sounding. Um, uh, but anyway, uh, these grows uh, in caves so, uh, at some places. You can use a shear to get them and you can also bone meal them to make them more. Wow, they actually can grow on the grass. What? Wow, now I did not know this. I did not know this. That's actually cool. Uh, oh, I am destroying stuff. That's not good. Uh, amethyst crystals. These look really amazing for decoration. It will be really nice. And let's see. Oh no, I am. Oh, Survival. 
It seems that this does not hurt me. But if I go to the, the this thing, yeah, that hurts me over time. Huh? You can see it drips. So question is, do I need to uh, creative um, dripstone block? Do I need to have a dripstone like here? maybe over time it will grow that's a good question we might figure that out at some point oh we also have these um, what's that called uh, rooted dirt that grows root um, let's try that aha uh -huh. But it also just grows downwards, it will not grow upwards. But if you manage to get these dirts, then it seems that it's just easy to bone meal them, to have some more. Uh, this looks uh, amazing, it, it was the Azalea. Oh no, what was that? Uh, what was that called? Uh, spore Blossom. Okay. Oh, I mixed up that up with the azalea trees, which looks amazing. Especially, I mean, I will definitely uh, harvest these leaves uh, in game as much as I can to make some uh, lovely decorations. I mean, at last we have leaves that actually have some nice looking flowers on it. Uh, I would love to have them in uh, multiple colors blue red, yellow, and blue, and so on, and so on. Um, I don't really know that what the, the spore blossom is good for, because uh, you might see that it emits particles in the air. Some of them are at like greater distances, like it's like 10-15 blocks. That's so cool. They make uh, cute little sounds. Uh, maybe even cuter than foxes. <laughs> and they are definitely having fun. So they are fine walking on the land, although much slower. But they are really fun to watch while in water. Uh, seems the goat finally got rid of the cow which means that i will have to be careful if i keep goats around uh, because uh, yeah i mean that's just a c cow but i guess uh, they would do the same thing to the sheep or all other animals it just uh, feels a bit strange <laughs> oh, but these are fun times definitely and I would really love to build with these blocks uh, hopefully uh, the LTT server gets uh, updated to 1.17 at some point uh, yeah that would be nice actually to build with these whoa sorry bye bye uh, anyway, I think that this would be all for now. I still have to read into the, the details to figure out uh, what uh, each block is actually good for, uh, what can they do, but uh, most definitely this update gave overall really nice textures and really nice new things that will be amazing <laughs> to build with, like this spore blossom or what in my hand. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then please like, share, subscribe. You know the drill. Follow me on Twitch. Follow me on Twitter. Please. <laughs> Have a wonderful day, everybody. Bye-bye.